Sovereignty Day, to me, means what these two gentlemen fought for, Chito Harjo and Charlie Coker, in the early 1900s, and uh, we'll continue fighting. Just the struggles they went through, uh, and they still carry on today. And for us, our, what our ancestors went through, we're still continuing fighting. We'll continue fighting that battle to protect our sovereignty. We've had many, many challenges in our history, and many victories, but many dark days. And Chief Hill's recognition of July 9th as our Sovereignty Day is appropriate because it recognizes the anniversary of our historic win in the McGirt decision. But it's about more than just McGirt. It's about our spirit of survival, our spirit of protecting our people, our culture, our language, our land so that future gener generations have a better life. And that's what we celebrate today. The significance of Sovereignty Day to me as the Attorney General points out a very important premise, but it's also the recognition of our history, of our elders and our ancestors for all that they sacrificed and all that they strategized and dedicated to so that we could have what we have now and have it recognized. It is my commitment that justice is seen all the way through from our elders to our children, wherever they may be within our reservation. That includes doing cross deputization trainings with our federal and our state partners on what are best practices. We know how to heal our people. We know how to protect our people. And so I think it is our responsibility as well as our knowledge. We have some of the best trained practitioners, law enforcement, lawyers, victims advocates, everyone bringing all of these professionals to the table with the commitment to protect our people as well as seeing that justice is served. Muscogee Creek Nation has always had the ability to govern oneself. We didn't have anybody have to tell us that we had to, we could we could govern ourselves. We always knew we could, and we've done it for hundreds of years. And so, really, it's just a celebration of uh, really just uh, acknowledging that fact and that uh, that we have governed ourselves, and we will always govern ourselves. We always can, and we always will. It's important to us all. It's a historic day for all of Muscogee Creek Nation, the citizens as well as indigenous people around the world. I felt that we need to honor that as, as well. It may not be recognized federally or, or nationally, but it is here in Muscogee Creek Nation. We're, we're still here. We're going to continue to be here, and we'll fight for everything that we have.